Hey guys! Okay, so today we will be doing a cook your catch video. I'm going to be making redfish on the half shell with a really light lemon, garlic, white wine, and cilantro sauce. And uh, we're going to accompany that with some sweet potato fries and a light salad. Um, I know you guys really want to see more like actual fishing videos and trust me, I am right there with you. I just honestly haven't had a lot of time to go out on the water lately. Um, I've been doing so much with the boat um, to get it ready for my charters and the weather has been weird and on top of that they just opened the spillway so if you're um from louisiana or know the spillway it doesn't really help the fishing around here but um hopefully soon i'll be able to get back out there and at least explore some more and um at least try you know to catch some fish so promise next time i go out there i'll take my gopros and um i'll keep you in the loop but for now i hope you guys really like this recipe all right, let's get started. I apologize in advance for the really harsh lighting today. It's super gloomy outside, so I don't really have a lot to work with and the lights in my kitchen are absolutely terrible. Anyways, okay, so the first thing you wanna start doing, um, and I'll show you guys everything. I have to lift everything up today, but um, to make the sweet potatoes, you take a whole potato. Um, I like to peel it first and then um, just cut it up in little slices like this. And then you're gonna cut these slices into fries. You want to try to make them, the actual slices themselves, kind of thin because they'll cook faster. Um, and then I like to cut up some fresh basil and thyme. And then you want to put, you want to put those. After you cut them up, you just kind of sprinkle them on potatoes as well as some sea salt that I forgot to get out. Sweet potatoes are obviously sweet, so you want to try to some pepper. You want to try to season them with a lot of flavors that add to the sweetness. All right, so you want to mix this all together so all the little fries have some kind of seasoning or um, leaves on them. And then sometimes I like to add some, if you have some dry basil or dry oregano, anything like that. Oregano. I love any kind of fries. You probably already know this, guys, because I, every time I cook, a side has to be some kind of potato. All right, so they should look something like this. All right, and you can put them in the oven. I actually just bought an air fryer and I'm so excited about this because I've actually made potatoes or um, fries in this before and it really does work as good as people say it does. They, I can make fries in like, what does it say? 12 to 16 minutes compared to having to leave them in the oven for like All right. half an hour. Let's start with the fish. Okay, so now for the fish. Remember, you wanna to try to put in the potatoes as soon as you can before anything else, because those take the longest to cook. So we have a redfish filet. We're gonna actually use the grill outside today, so um, I like to double up on the foil if you do like to use foil. If not, you can actually put the redfish because it's on the half shell, like directly on the grill. Um, I just don't like it because then you have to clean up the scales. Um, so anyway, so you're gonna put some garlic powder. Some basil. And some oregano on the actual filet itself. And then we wanna make the sauce. I'm just making it in here, the little dressing that we're gonna put on it. So we wanna use, and I'm really bad with like measuring stuff guys, so I apologize, but this is the first time that I'm doing this kind of recipe for the redfish, so um, yeah, you just kind of like, not measure, just kind of like eyeball it. So we're gonna use some white wine, a whole lemon, Okay. 
gonna use some minced garlic. chops cilantro. So here's some cilantro. I'm gonna chop it up really quick. Alright, got some fresh cilantro. I'm gonna put it in here. Alright, so now we have this kind of marinade. Make sure that you create like a bowl with the tinfoil because this is a lot of liquid and you want it to kind of soak up all this liquid when it's in the grill. So you can see it's like a bowl. So you can, we're gonna, we're gonna pour the liquid all in this and it shouldn't leak out of anywhere. That is how you, you want it. Now we wait. Now we're gonna make our salad. So you want some romaine lettuce. smaller dice them up that's fine too or if you want to eat them just throw them in their hole it's cool all right and then i like to add avocado i haven't eaten avocado in a really long time when i say a really long time i mean like a week <laughs> so i'm gonna eat this whole avocado but you but need apple cider vinegar, you need oil, olive oil, you need um, garlic, I just like to use the powder because it's easier, um, you need salt, pepper, and lastly you need, what else did I use, oh a little bit of honey, it adds like a little bit of sweetness um, and it kind of helps cut the um, Vinegar taste, it's the um, apple cider vinegar is super, super strong. So, so you will know when it's ready, when the meat is nice and white and flaky. So that is so ready, so good, oh my gosh. Oh yeah, these I added a little slice of, little slices of, of lemon. If you wanna be fancy with it, like me, you can do that too. <laughs> it does nothing though. Like I said before, I really appreciate you guys watching this video and I hope that you actually try this at home and let me know how you like it. It's super easy, super healthy. Shouldn't take you more than 30 minutes um, and that's probably because of the, the potatoes take 
12 or 16 minutes of those 30 minutes to cook. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and please feel free to let me know what other kind of videos you want to watch in the comments below. I know fishing videos, so <laughs> don't worry about that. Um, but if there's any kind of fish that you want to learn how to cook or um, fillet, um, I'm actually getting my uh, Bubba Blade electric fillet knife pretty soon and I for sure will do a catch, cook, and clean video for you guys because I have had so many questions on how good that that um, that knife is and if it's worth $125, I totally get it. Um, so yes, look forward to that. Have a great night, guys.